One time for the queen And you already know Make some noise for your boy It's cut different, baby. Uh, hey. <laughs> <laughs>
lost it all, I know I it know hurt. hurt I'm getting bigger and bigger, went through a growth spurt I'm 10 down, even when my fucking toes, toes hurt down, and, and, and until that nigga dead, I can't get closure fuck, fuck, fuck that, Smiley G, don't bring the chorus uh-uh. in No competition, hit that button, make them force yeah. quit They picking cases up, like they driving forklifts I learned my lesson, I'm staying away from Portsmouth Good. <laughs> hey, I ain't gonna lie, bro. Yeah, go. Dig that. They picking cases up like a forklift, boy. God damn, boy, that was a bar. Hey, hey, shout out to my cousin Smiley G, boy. That was nice. Man. <laughs> shout out my nigga Smiley. My brother Yago. Yeah, <laughs> hang on that, man. We need to do a video of that shit. He bullshitting. On First that. number two was weak. <laughs> What you been up to, Hefe? Oh, man. Working, that. man. Working, creating content. Uh, what, what kind of content? Man, uh, my car content. My 392 content. You gonna shout okay. your shit out? Tell them what, uh, where to find you? Find me on TikTok, 392, Hefe. You see the mods. See what I'm doing next. Everything. That's what's okay. up. Car content. That's a big that's lane. That's crazy. I didn't know that. Yeah, that's a big lane. That's crazy. They heard about it before me. Oh, Lord. I've been saying something about it, though. I've been checking you out, though. I saw you. I saw your TikTok. Video. You knew? I saw you. He posted it. I saw it. That's crazy. Uh, it's just, hey, I saw a little snippet or something. He, he was breaking it down and got them it. Yeah, he know what he's talking about. That was a, that was a. Uh, he know what he's well, he talking wasn't, about. He wasn't really talking. It was just oh, okay. you know, gotcha. but I don't like slash. Gotta check it out. Yeah, it was like, like slash. Yeah, something yeah, like that. Yeah, slash shows and shit. Word, word. That's what's up, man. What you been up to, Big Diego? Shit, man. Same old shit, bro. Trying to make it happen. What? What? Lance, he said, and traffic trying to make shit happen. Mm. That's it. It's every day with me, bro. Period. Well, last week, I started off, started my week off in uh, New York, Buffalo, New York. Mm-hmm. From Buffalo, New York, a nigga had to shoot down to Kentucky to pick up a load. Then I had to do a 20-hour ride to Laredo, Texas. Mm. Shit was not fun. Not fun at all? But I got it done. Period. I mean, when I got down there, it was nice, but on my way out, Cause I had a load going from Texas to Tennessee. Hmm. I had to go through Border Patrol. Oh no, mm-hmm. man! The and what? I didn't realize I didn't realize that you had to do that when you didn't cross the border. And I had just got done smoking. Mm. Detrimental. Not a fun experience. But uh, after they searched my vehicle and treated me like I tried to have thirty. Uh, uh, Latin people or Spanish people in my in the back of my truck. Hey, we don't joke about that type shit, bro. Well, Chuck, be ready. I, uh, no, I'm just <laughs> <laughs> I drove to Tennessee and then I brought my ass back home. What you been up to, Arco? Man, working, 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 and then the crib. God damn it, boy, that's how much I've been. God damn it, working. You hear me? Uh, seven days ain't no joke, boy. Still on my ass. But you know, gotta get it. You feel me? Been um, I've been watching a little bit of TV, man. We got uh, that movie with Mike Epps and Snoop Dogg. I had to check that out. The Underdog. Uh, yeah, I that's did a, check that that's, out. That's, 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 that's actually what our topics. Yeah, no doubt. Uh, I ain't watched it yet. And uh, been watching some of those uh, twenty v ones on YouTube. <laughs> I don't know if y'all hip to that. <laughs> Yeah. Where they had the ladies come through, introduce themselves and things like that. So I've been watching a few of those and just chilling, man. Uh oh. Been been experimenting with the vegan food lately. That's what I've been doing, man. Uh, uh. I'm uh my ass. Hey, when I say I I'm, I'm I'm damn near there, bruh. Like it just give me a few more recipes that I can juggle through <laughs> throughout the week, you feel me? <laughs> and I it might be over with for the meat, bro. Like for real. Like they've been hooking me up for real. Uh down there at the Munchin' Buddha, her name's Shamika. 
Mm-hmm. But uh, she like the vegan chef down there or whatever. But it shit bang for real. I ain't gonna lie. What's some of the? What's, I'm about uh, to say what's some. So I've had uh, the soul rolls. They got uh, mac and cheese, greens and yams in it. And then I had this uh, vegan chicken sandwich. So it's kind of like uh, a deep fried cauliflower patty, something like that. You know, but it tastes they like got, chicken. Well, Wait, it don't really taste like chicken, no. no. But uh, it's kind of like uh, it gives you the the texture. You know what I mean? And it's it's uh, firm enough to make a sandwich out of. So they throw the tomatoes, <laughs> tomatoes, onions, <laughs> uh, lettuce, and then she got like this little sauce she make for it, bro. Shit, fire! I ain't gonna lie. Uh, you just ain't knock it till you try it. Real talk. <laughs> Gotta try it, bro. Got to. What's up with you, uh, O Black? Talk to me. Shit, brother. It's uh, it's up with me. Same shit though. You know what I'm saying? I'm grinding. Trying to uh, uh get some things and pers- you know what I'm saying lined up uh you know what I'm saying with nigga being on parole and shit man so I'm trying to get these folks up off my back man you know what I'm saying so I'll be able to really like expand my wings man all these restrictions and restraints and shit like that bro like shit for the birds so. Mm-hmm. Whatever little hula hoops and shit they want a nigga to, you know what I'm saying? <laughs> got to twerk, twerk, twerk yeah, with. Gotta, <laughs> gotta, gotta do the nigga jig. Yeah, you know what I'm saying? That's what it, you know what I'm saying? So outside of that, man, uh, you know, music. I got some new content coming up, you know what I'm saying? Uh, so it is about to be a real busy year, you know what I'm saying? So yes, sir. the launch of my own shit, uh, my boss association, you know what I'm saying? And on, on top of what I got going on with the network, you feel me? So outside Amen. of that, brother, that's what up. it is. Like bro. he said, it's up with him. That's right, it's up with me. Chuck, what up? tell me something good, big dog. Um, well, we, we've gained a lot of subscribers the last few days. Got some views. Uh, my girl's birthday was the other day. Got through that. Now, happy belated birthday. And, uh Bought her an Apple Watch, so now I'm in financial Uh-oh. recovery mode. <laughs> yeah, I get it. Oh, so it's nice, nice stuff. Uh, he said we doing week big full things. Of work. <laughs> hey, listen, <clears throat> I'm about to give a round of applause to ourselves because we've officially surpassed a hundred thousand views, and we uh we've made it to episode fifty, man. Episode 50, man. Yeah, it is because we did more episodes in the last six months than we did in the two years prior to even having a podcast. So Mm -hmm. that's something, a big accomplishment, you know what I mean? Yeah, yeah, yeah. We done been through a lot and ain't shit stopped us from coming in here and doing what's necessary. So, you know, kudos to us. Respectful. For sure. Um, 100. Let me see where I want to where I want to take the pie, man. Let's get to some chick beef. Yeah. The bitches, <laughs> bitches is at each other's bitches necks right man. now. You Crazy. hear me? Uh, where do we start? Do we start with the big dogs and no. then let's start? Okay, so mm-hmm. Lotto and Ice Spice. Yeah, let's, yeah. Let's do <laughs> um, yeah. Funny. I don't. First and foremost, I don't even understand where their problem came from. The only thing I can think of is Ice Spice is cool with Nikki. Yeah. And Lotto is cool we with Carter. And we let's go, bitch. <laughs> Are you? Uh, t- you know how that's you, out of that, oh, that show, man. That's like big homie. Yeah, guilty by association. That's so nigga, exactly. I'm gonna hit with him. You gonna hit with him? Yo, big homie don't like my big homie. Yeah, so so I'm, now I'm I don't like ass. you, bitch. A, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Did you hear it? They did sound. I know, I, but I seen. I seen Big Lotto in the Bronx <coughs> in the video. Yeah, oh, yeah, wait, I you heard this, so. Yeah. Yeah, did you see Ice busy. Spice in the... Um... I did. It's the, that fart shit. <coughs> no, I ain't talking about that. That's I a part of her. I did see her in the, the background, though. Yeah, I know what you talking about. She was in the background in the uh, when she was on the Sprinter. Mm-hmm. I ain't heard them neither, so just for uh, our sake, we're going to play them, you know. Fast forward this. We this ain't for the pie, but this is for us to be able to actually hear what we talking about. You know what I mean? Can't just speak on some shit and not have heard it. Well, What's heard uh? It. But on the side, Lotto's song is called "Back Outside." 
Nah. Nah. It's nah. Called, shit nah. ain't even came out. It's called uh Sunday something. Sunday, Sunday service. service. Yeah. Ooh. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> she came so yeah, crazy, bro. Yeah, just off the spice. little snippet I heard. Yeah, she sound crazy. And going that spice shit called fart or some shit. That shit. I ain't heard. That shit weird. Thank you to shit. Yeah. That's what it's called. Yeah, fart. Weird. Yeah. Okay. This, this, we have to. We have to. We have to see what she talking Damn, about. Damn, she. So who is, who, is, who is this first one? Ice Spice. The fuck I'm going to say in the intro? Uh, you think you the shit. Who let her release that shit? If Nikki heard any of that before it was released, uh, shame on Nikki for even. That's endorsing not endorsing her. That's even a nah, she got some hot shit with Nikki. I'm not saying that, that that's not my dispute, sir. I'm just saying. I'm speaking of this one track in general. Letting her put that out for even that. Well, who's who say she? she ain't, I she mean, ain't I, 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 what I, again? <coughs> so she's what, not. Again, no, what I said was, okay. I, I what, like her home. What I said was, if Nikki heard this before it was released, mm-hmm. and she didn't. Object to mm-hmm. <laughs> yeah. Shame on her. Yeah, is what I, is, you know what I'm saying. I'm not saying yeah. that. I'm not saying that she don't got. They don't. They don't have no fire collaborations. I'm not saying none of that. But that song was. And she let her drop that shit. What that I'm song. That so. that song is booski. What you beat. what if Penny what she was saying was going beat. to a different type of beat, do a different track. It might have. It wouldn't have had no different. No, it wouldn't have had no different type of effect. That was not it. Yeah, that's um, that's if that's how she's coming, <laughs> if that's how she coming, Lotto gonna have a field day with her. Man, work. Lotto really yeah, gets to it. I ain't gonna lie, I fucks with Lotto. Mm-hmm. Yeah, she really gets to it with the rapping though. A nasty. Yeah, yeah. you know, uh, old girl ain't fucking with her. That's why she pulled up. And, and yeah, she you know could, I mean? yeah, like, yeah. We, we gonna, gonna talk about that right after here. that. Talking shit on her, was, on her on this song. Bro, trying, he ain't trying to play it. What? But that Sunday sir Yeah, that that shit. Was I am gonna right. play it. It went on Apple. But uh, oh, yeah, yeah she find that snippet. Mm-hmm. Spice don't stand a chance. No, that 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 little drill, bop flow she got mm-hmm. that don't fare off well in a. A battle type of uh, environment, yeah, yeah beef and again, type. Because it's yeah. like she couldn't even, she couldn't even get her words off. You know what I mean? Like as far as I couldn't even tell it was a diss record at first. You know what I mean? Like it's just again, that's what I'm saying. All that, all that flying. The, you the know, beat like certain certain beats and shit. Like I can't <clears throat> come saying no gangster shit, bro. On no R and B track, bro. Yeah, but I, gonna, I actually you know think like the it ain't going. I actually think the record would have been all right had she not labeled it a diss record. Basically, what I'm saying, like it's it, it kind of sound okay. You know what I'm saying? But you, when, it when raises you expectation on, it, whenever you say that it's supposed to be. You expect exactly. something that you didn't get. I get what you're saying. It was mm-hmm. definitely a big disappointment. I just, either way, I would. I think I was. I would have uh, took that better if I wouldn't have heard what Lotto had to say first. <laughs> Cause uh, the way homegirl came, the fuck, mm-hmm. spice baby, <laughs> leave that woman alone. Mm. <laughs> um, it's just like a snippet. On the oh, I, can, I can't Instagram. find it. Go to Lotto Instagram. Hold on now. Do that part. <coughs> <coughs> Oh, I'm about to say, uh, and in the group, yeah, I'm about to say you posted it, brother. Ice Spice just, it's her flow, man. She got that, like he said, she got that drill flow. It's that part that ain't gone. I feel like with certain certain artists, is this like, yeah. you ever hear an artist or whatever, you know what I'm saying, and, and you be like, man, I just can't see them doing the diss track. All right, here right. go. Here go the snippet. That's y'all. not them. She ready for it. Every time y'all put me with them, don't be big drum. Don't be big drum. You can already tell how she coming. It's already better than what mm-hmm. we've heard already from Lotto. 
And then twenty black. I just want that one on one. Why is she so nervous? Hey, what's wrong with her? And she in her hood though. Yeah, she pulled up. <laughs> in New York. She pulled up in, in the New Bronx. York. I'm trying yeah. to shoot the video of that. <laughs> that, that, that. That ice can't say nothing else. Leave her alone. Yeah, it's over after that. <laughs> it's over after that. It, it's either it's either it's either it's either let it go or fight or. or do some obnoxious up, shit and or y'all set up a boxing match yeah. and both get some money out of this shit. But we both know that it ain't about to happen. Yeah. Mm-hmm. Yeah. Um I definitely don't see Shorty going down Lotto's way. So let me ask you, have y'all heard the Megan Thee Stallion and Nicki Minaj disses? Mm-hmm. I have. I ain't heard the um I ain't heard Megan shit. I've but, heard the talk of uh, of of I've not heard the actual material. Well, I see. I feel <laughs> the same way you feel about uh, hearing Ice Spice after hearing Lotto first. Man, I heard Nikki after I heard Megan. I'm like, bro, just cut this shit off. You feel me? That's just how I felt about it, bro. Like, I didn't like neither one of those disses. Are you serious? I didn't like Nikki's diss like, or Megan's diss. Yeah, hey, Megan like came Nikki's. with it. I ain't gonna lie. You like two? I like Nikki's, bro. Or, she was talking that shit. Yeah, she was. To me. She was popping it a little. I don't know. It's that flow. <clears throat> it's that animated flow shit. I don't like that. She was talking. I feel that like shit. in That's this like, type of situation, this ain't the time to blah 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 yeah. blah. blah. <laughs> no, <laughs> bitch. It's time to get to it. It's time yeah. to really yeah. get in your rapper bag and get in this bitch ass. Yeah, like, don't nobody want to hear that. Leave yeah. Roman. Uh, yeah. Uh, yeah. Uh, yeah. Uh, Leave, Leave Roman, Roman at home. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> Bitch, I want to hear Nick. I want to hear yeah, you well, yeah. kick that one shit. Like, and then Megan Thee Stallion. I'm just free Tory for one. Let me start off Respect. by saying that. Hey. Um, How you get shot in those scars? How you get shot and ain't got no scars? <laughs> like, Nicki was saying some shit. Hey, boy. But it's just that delivery. That just ain't. I hate it. I've always hated that, though. She said you fucked your mama's man when she died. Child. Bye. But see, we have we have we don't know how factual that is. It don't matter. It don't. We didn't no, it don't, because we didn't know how factual it was when uh when dude said, first off, fuck the what'd he say? He said, fuck your what, bitch. What, the fuck your bitch and the click you claim. <laughs> He said, "Dude, like, and you dude, claim to be a player, but I yeah. fucked your wife." He he did. He, hey, he got a point. How serious did we take that? Extremely, exactly, <laughs> because we saw Faith with Pop, like it was pictures. Of, mm-hmm. You know, yeah. yeah. Making the stallion ain't been famous long enough to where. I mean, you know, yeah. I'm not really a fan of Megan anyway, because yeah. free Tory. Hey. Um, <laughs> I think Megan got her mama killed. Damn. That's deep. In the first place. Yeah, but we, we don't want to go down that I rabbit hole. I don't know nothing about none of that. We don't want to go down that rabbit hole. I just heard one song, and, and I like it. <laughs> <laughs> hey, that motherfucking one song came out of nowhere, didn't it? It did, though. Yeah, right after Mom Duke's passed. Damn. So, um... Where y'all think it's gonna go from here? You think it's gonna be because Megan dropped the song first, right? And Nikki responded to her. Do you think Megan is gonna double back with a? Yeah, yup. Yeah. Y'all feel like the first song that Nikki put out there was just like the, the little jag, mm-hmm. jab to see where she you at it. with it. She mm. say it in the song like we we gonna leave that for the next install. Oh yeah, next yeah. Mm. Hmm. Well, I hope she really getting her back to back shit. I wonder if she's trying to like too. get on her, get on her uh, Dennis Rodman shit. You feel me? Just r- get real, get, bully shit. yeah. Just just irritate the fuck out of her. You know what I'm saying? Yeah. Just drive her crazy. On some Draymond I mean? Green shit. Have her have her do some shit she wouldn't normally do. You know what I mean? Dead mama, lie on your dead mama. Man, she you said some shit. Dead mama. I ain't gonna. Lie. Did you see? Did y'all see uh, Nikki going live? I think it was on Instagram. Uh, mm-hmm. Went on her I little see it. I seen talk. like a clip with the end of Yeah, she on there talking about uh, your dead mama, your dead mama. I'm t- going crazy. I'm like, crazy. no, I said, no, she didn't. I, I thought Nikki was about to get canceled after that. I don't but think, I, I don't really think Megan ca- cared care that much. It's, she lied on yeah, her mama repeatedly whenever. Mm-hmm. 
You know what I mean? Yeah. She done yeah. put it on her mama how many times and she was lying. Yeah. So. Go on, Gail King, and they ain't crying. Hey, mm. She's yeah. funny. <laughs> I just felt like what she did was like um, light. Like she just read all the different what's the names and just made a way to make it rhyme and just. Mm-hmm. That's what I'm saying. Nikki is playing with this. That ain't how Nikki coming. It can't be. No, oh, that was just a little. Yeah. Man. Yeah. Like, quit playing with me. <laughs> Man, this it's going somewhere, though. I'll tell you that. I don't know where. But this ain't the, this ain't the end of the line. I'll tell you that. <laughs> well, Megan about to... Um, Megan about to go team back up with Cardi. Megan about to go on tour. I believe. That's crazy, though. I mean, you think about it, a lot, of those, a lot of females really gravitate to Cardi. I think fe- Cardi did that of, on purpose. A lot of female artists, they really like gravitate to. But That's I think she probably make it Nikki, easier. But Nikki allowed that to happen as well, though, for the amount of time she sat back, not reaching out, collaborating, doing nothing with nobody. Exactly. You know what I'm saying? Cardi, she didn't sat here and extended it out. She, you know what I'm saying? She didn't. She Car- Cardi about her bag. Yeah. So mm-hmm. she, so everybody and every per, every person that every female artist that she didn't came out that she didn't collaborate with within the last, I say, three four years. All bangers, especially her, her shit, her and Megan. That's a duo. But shit, she got bigger fish to fry. She going through a divorce. She ain't worried about these hoes. Shit, she got them in and out of court. When you say uh, Cardi about her business, what you mean? I said she's about her paper. I mean, what you mean by that though? I like mean, she was working. Oh, time out with all the other females. Yeah. Okay, I was about to say, don't think Cardi can't get on no bullshit too. <laughs> and she had the motherfucking blood bitches running that club and beat up them bitches that was fucking upset. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, Cardi, get on that. I'm already hit, but she she bought her paint for sure. Yeah, you thought that shit was funny. Child, bye. Oh <laughs> <laughs> uh, man. So, um, y'all remember we had the top, we was talking about most deaf and Drake a couple of weeks ago. Yeah, I re- definitely remember that. And <laughs> you know, I hate on my boy. I told you, most deaf was, most deaf was talking about hip hop and what you. is and what that. Weird. One mic, man. One mic, man. <laughs> we was talking about, uh, most deaf be, uh, being pure hip hop and Drake not being hip hop and stuff like that. Did y'all mm-hmm. see that photo of most deaf? I sure did. What y'all think about that? That is not hip hop, my brother. I wouldn't. I wouldn't hip to that. I'll tell you that right now. I, <laughs> he said I wouldn't hip to that. I wouldn't hip to that, bro. Uh, my dude out this. here. Go ahead. I'm about to play this. Looking like he uh, ready to sell some Girl Scout cookies, man. He, mm. <laughs> got them big ass boots and that skirt on. He acting crazy. Looking crazy. Let me see. Let's we'll see what Flocka got to say. No, I don't usually do this, but uh, that most. That- but you're tripping. <laughs> you really tripping, my boy. You go from goddamn telling Drake he not hip hop to putting on a Roddy Roddy pipe to dress like a wrestler. <laughs> so that's what hip hop is. Or I never in my life do like I feel like this like. But my God, this ain't something, bro. That lame with you did. Now you just made that really look like hip hop. And you look like a hater. Yo, that's yo, why. yo. Exactly. Shout out to uh, Urban Politicians TV, man. Real talk. Yeah, that's where that that little clip came from. He said, "You look like what? a hater." <laughs> I damn near want to get on some Sanaa Lathan <laughs> shit. Like, <laughs> when did you fall in love with hip hop <laughs> on some brown sugar shit? <laughs> uh, who, who who called him a hater? That was you, wasn't it? Yeah, you was damn near on the money with that. Mm-hmm. Because you can't say something about some yeah. hip hop and then turn around and do that. Yeah, yeah, for sure. What is the point? Why is niggas putting on dresses? Hmm. Now, now it's ain't society, the time. bro. Now it definitely ain't the time, bro. You y'all just heard Cat Williams. The powers month. that God, be, damn. man. Did y'all what? wait? Did y'all hear most deaf's apology to Drake? Mm-mm. I did not. He apologized. He but have. it was only after Common got on somewhere and said something about he said something good about Drake. Uh, okay. Bro, these niggas is weird. He found out somebody, 
He ain't had nobody on his side, huh? Shit, most death was pretty much on that with him because of what went on with Drake and Common back in the day. Word. You know, Drake uh, and Common used had beef. Yeah, yeah. yeah. Matter of fact, I do remember that. Yeah, yeah. Man. Mm-hmm. That whole verse was about. They Common. had. They made a, a whole mixtape. Bother me uh, when the guys get that. Drake versus like Common. Frog. Yeah. yeah. Do you, you know what they was beefing over? No, I don't remember. That shit was so long ago. Uh, Serena Williams. About 15 years ago. For real? Yeah. The tenant, ain't that her name? Mm-hmm. Serena? Yeah, it's okay. beefing over Serena. Man. I mean, hey. Oh, so that's what he was. Okay. I think he mentioned that on the uh, For All the Dogs album. Now, he was dissing um, Serena's husband. She married to somebody. I know what okay. you're talking about. Yeah. He keep going at him. Mm-hmm. He on his ass behind okay. Serena. Serena must have got that goddamn. Boy, well, you you see you seen you seen that wagon she dragging goddamn. That's kind of like uh, well, shoot. That's like uh, Chris Brown, Quavo over Karuchi. You see them niggas at that uh, at the fucking uh, that at that fashion event, and they sat them right next to each other. <laughs> Boy, they look salty <laughs> than the motherfucker. <laughs> uh, Chris Brown, he made a comment afterwards, like, you know, I ain't about to fuck up my bag over no little nigga. Mm. <coughs> so, yeah, you got me there. <laughs> For sure. But, man, I don't, I don't be getting it to where a nigga can... Just like a... Like, my issue ain't with this nigga. Yeah. My issue ain't with this nigga, bro. No, I think their issue was with each other. But my my point, my my thing is this though. She the she know what's going on too. Well, so cool. uh, how can you you know what I'm saying? You feel what I'm saying? Like, cause I, I can't get the pussy nigga if she don't give it to me. Right. Facts. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? Right. And I'm sure both of you niggas at some point in time were pillow talking. So she know both of y'all niggas don't like each other. Mm-hmm. Facts. And now mm-hmm. we both sitting right next to each other. But the thing about it is, <laughs> that's, not, and, 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 but that, that's 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 the irony of the shit because a female will be vindictive like that, bro, and sit there and play the card like that. Mm-hmm. And just let it play out. Mm. Chris Brown had smoke with any nigga that was even willing to date Karuchi, bro. I'm, that's what I'm saying, bro. He was like a soldier boy ass for <laughs> commenting on some shit on Instagram. Chris Brown is a light skinned nigga at heart, like mm-hmm. <laughs> just own I that. No, bro. Like I can't, I can't really, I ain't not over no pussy, bro. I like that. Yeah, I'm not like that. Not like that, bro. Like it got a, 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 and the dynamics of the situation too. Like the simple fact that you just fucked her, nigga. Okay, you fucked her. Some niggas don't know how to handle their feelings. You know what I mean? Yeah, Get facts. That. Like that, that, you know what I'm saying? Like going crazy. Yeah, it's 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 things that play a part on the reaction call. You know what I'm saying? That comes behind mm-hmm. a nigga fucking with whoever you. Fucked with, fucking with, you know what I'm saying? Or fucked with, like it. Some yeah. niggas can't handle that. Yeah, some I, niggas nowadays a lot of all in a bitch. Some niggas ain't got a lot of bitches. Some that some niggas that might be the only bitch. But we talking about niggas Every, with millions of dollars. That, that shit don't mean nothing. That they fuck elevation. Hey, sometimes that you know, sometimes money don't matter when it comes to that. Nigga, that's my bitch, nigga. <laughs> <laughs> you, you know see what I'm saying? Some that. niggas look. You know some what niggas what I'm like, for real though. Some uh, niggas kill you yeah, over that bitch. Don't give fuck how much. Y'all remember that video when dude got out of jail and his yeah. baby mama had a new baby? They had like a five year old kid. Dude was like, "Nigga, you ready to die? Yeah. You ready to die behind this pussy? Yeah. You ready to die?" Like. Hey. Get the fuck out, <laughs> dude! Oh. Left his son and he walked. The fuck, a, oh, I ain't about to die over this bitch. Over I'd have left too. Some niggas. <laughs> my son would have been going with me, gang. Yeah, on that. Yeah, but yeah, I'm yeah. saying I'd have been gone. You ain't just. You ain't taking my bitch and the family. No, come on, son. <laughs> <laughs> you we out. We out of here, gang. Nah, but um, let's talk about Wario, man. You know we got to follow Wario all the way through this shit. It says Brock Lesnar removed. If you don't know who Wario is, I'm talking about Vince McMahon, <laughs> Mexican Vince. 
It says, Brock Lesnar removed from WWE game after alleged involvement in Vince McMahon allegations. Mm. He fucking with other people's shit now. Brock Lesnar has been removed from a... De- all right, I'm not reading that again. On January 25th, a lawsuit was filed hitting Vince McMahon and allegations of sexual trafficking, abuse, and more. You can read... The f- this shit is weak. Throughout the lawsuit, there were also several unnamed parties, including one who was referred to as WWE Superstar, who was involved in the alleged situation. WWE Superstar was described as someone who was a former UFC heavyweight champion and was negotiating with WWE at a time that alleged events occurred. While it's very important to express that Brock Lesnar was at no point named in the lawsuit, the Wall Street Journal reported that the person being referred to as WWE superstar was Lesnar. Who else was a UFC heavyweight champion that crossed over into WWE? Like, that Mm -hmm. makes no sense. Ken Shamrock? You described described him him without without, (laughs) You described him without saying his name. Yeah. Right. They tried to sweep him. John Lord Nitus. Mm-hmm. Brock Lesnar. Fucking with Vinnie Mac. Yeah. She's gonna get real. But you think somebody shit, I, somebody has to have an opinion. They, they, they wanted that title, shit. They, they, they got it now, <laughs> boy. Shit. <laughs> it ain't the title we ain't. wanted. <laughs> Ain't Brock Lesnar still married to um? I have no clue. What's this nigga married to? You know I don't keep All up. I know with is, ass, man. I don't know. This time, this nigga Vincent Kennedy McMahon is going to fuck <laughs> down. Yeah, he bringing too many other people hey, down with him. That nigga going he married to Sable, yeah. guy. Damn, for real. Brock Lesnar married Disable. Damn, what? Work. Um, okay, I remember her. Yeah, for sure. Hmm. So how you think she at home looking at dude? Yeah, she she knew. She, 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 she probably that. was one of the original mm-hmm. little. Yeah. yeah. The Attitude way Vince. Era. The, you, you, you know, how, you know yeah. how Vince was getting hey, down yeah. back then. You want to get down with the team, He baby? was putting his daughter <laughs> on camera to get uh drugged and married and kissed on and all types uh, of, types know, of crazy, crazy shit yeah Damn, you know do that. to his yeah, own daughter shit. rich people like when you would you when you was just talking about um because he made it um the whole situation with vince as far as i don't think he's gonna get stroked I do. You think I really don't. Don't save him. Bro, listen, <laughs> listen, the, the, the re, listen, the, re, the, the, re, the reason why I say that shit, bro, is because the money and the influence that this nigga got, bro, you got to think behind mm-hmm. the scenes. You got to think. This nigga is 78 years old, bro. Yeah. And his motherfucking been doing this shit since the 80s. Yeah. This is what that I'm going to say. So if you don't think that this nigga got any type of juice... For any time, because you uh, this whole time, not saying I'm not saying that there has not been any type of incidents that have came out before in the past on dude, mm-hmm. and they just get swept, you know, they get swept underneath the rug, and nobody don't really pay no attention to them. Mm-hmm. This one is just mm-hmm. one of the ones that is stuck. This ain't the first time though. He just got oh, in yeah. trouble for this shit three years ago. So I'm saying this one is stuck. This is what I'm gonna say. If y'all blocked up Cliff Huxtable. For popping pills at a time when that's what you was doing back then was popping pills and fucking. Mm-hmm. Y'all better lock up Wario for shitting on bitches' heads mm-hmm. and fucking making her fuck 12 dudes at a time. Mm-hmm. And what else was he doing, Chuck? He was on the gangbang mission. Yeah. He like them gangbangs. Boy, yeah, he doing <laughs> prostituting <laughs> and trafficking and all that. Right. Bill like wasn't doing none of that. He was just popping mollies, now. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. that's, just that's, just like that's just like the same shit with the uh with the uh uh Einstein dude. Harvey uh, Weinstein. Weinstein. Yeah. Is it Weinstein or Epstein? Epstein. Both, both the motherfuckers both of in trouble yeah. for some freaky shit, both right? Both them Steens. If you got Steen in your name, <laughs> boy, <laughs> this is bad. All them Steens. But the one that killed itself. That's Epstein. That's Epstein. Epstein. Okay. Mm-hmm. It was it's they still got documents coming out on dude. That's why from, from all the shit that he was, you know, what I'm saying all the shit that he was dealing with. Mm. But I honestly don't think, bro, that he would have did along. He was just too weak minded. 
They got a. Uh, I don't think he really would have did a whole bunch of time, bro. Like, come on, we got it. We just mm. had a dude that was the president for four years, nigga, and told you he grabbed he grabbed pussies, nigga. Mm-hmm. Man, he on. Um, come on, bro. He fighting the sexual recall. harassment this, on uh, camera. And, and, he and, and, and running for president. And, and, and running back for yeah. president. Yeah. Right, right the yeah. fuck come now. On, bro. And, and that's, so at the end of the day, if you think that these motherfuckers ain't got no, bro. Yeah, they gonna they gonna take care of They gonna, they gonna, on, they gonna go through the 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 the. The hazing the process, process mm-hmm. uh-uh. of the no he said, uh-uh. on the legal side, but <laughs> bro, this time, somebody got to go down for this. Yeah, shit, for sure. Bro. Not in for this sure. era when we protect. They we in a protecting women era, bro. And all these women is coming out speaking on what this man done. Respect and they took and they took a lot of and, fuck down and a lot of people want and a lot of them want money too. Even and he got the money. He got the money for it. He got the money to cash all of them out. It, mm-hmm. It's some of them that don't want shit, and they talking like they getting paid. Know that? I mean, to each, we, he make a point though. It's a it's you feel very. Me? I, I can hey, believe. It I don't believe, matter who I ain't talking. Like it's the way if he I get away with it, I wouldn't <laughs> be surprised. <laughs> but I'm saying though, the way I feel is you're going to jail now. <laughs> it's, 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 but it's, a, it's all a process. Mm-hmm. So you know what I'm saying? We'll go like just uh um like with uh, uh Deshaun Watson. Right mm-hmm. when he had all them sexual uh, lawsuit yeah. uh, allegations or whatever, right? Yeah, the one chick, she everybody, it was a, a couple of females who took their buyout, mm-hmm. settled out of court. It was yeah. like two females who didn't when they did, mm-hmm. just to do turn around and do the same thing, bro. A couple of months later, yeah, they they just kept coming, kept coming, kept coming. You gotta stop doing that. I'm but, up. Uh, I'm up. So you know what I'm saying, like. The process it'll make it look like, oh yeah, they gonna get stroked. At the end of the day, bro. I think what they gonna do if he don't go to jail, they they just gonna they just gonna bleed him dry. You know what I'm saying? Just Mm -hmm. make him go bankrupt one time and let. I don't think you could do that to Vince. What's uh? They gonna ring you up a couple M's, but he gonna end up like dude off Goodfellas. Uh, putting ketchup on this on this spaghetti. <laughs> <laughs> Listen, he didn't already ketchup step on down. Egg noodles. <laughs> he didn't already step down from TKO. He bended that, but he yeah he, he better do fact, he man. better do what Russell Simmons did and sell all his goddamn shit and go to Bilal and chill over there where ain't no extradition. Hey, I think it's too late for that. He should have been like you. If you, if you own your own planes and jets, and not, it ain't too late, Nick. It's a, it ain't nothing but a, it ain't nothing but a trip to the strip. <laughs> it's over with. I'm gone. Mm-hmm. Straight up. We That's figure the rest of that shit out when I get there. Okay. I'm out. Figure the rest of that shit out later. Yeah. I just gotta get there. Yeah. Better, <laughs> that nigga better. <laughs> that nigga better talk to Russ. All right, man. Let's talk about your top op. <laughs> It's your favorite time of pot. <laughs> Who? <laughs> your mm. top op. Nah. Brownie James. Say, you know, I hate being the one to say, I told you so. <clears throat> this ain't just nothing. This ain't personal. You just right here next to me. <laughs> Imagine this is JJ. You know. <laughs> I told you. This nigga ain't it. All right. Well, you want to read it? <laughs> you want to read it? I'll read it for you. Mm. This nigga <clears throat> ain't it. Brownie James is projected to go undrafted. In the ESPN's latest 2024 NBA mock draft, he's been having a rough go in college ball so far. I told you. His 2023-24 season stats is 5.6 points, 2.8 rebounds, 2.0 assists. (laughs) (laughs) <laughs> <laughs> that was a light <laughs> That was a shark yeah, I'm about to say Something behind that <laughs> Huh? There was something behind that Yeah, you gotta go That's check yourself after that have, Yeah <laughs> Hey, Chuck, oh, man. hey so. Chuck You still think he a decent role player? Hell well, yeah. you don't think he's tanking Just so they the Lakers could just sign him Instead of drafting him? Um, we... With numbers like that, see, you, that's crazy. See, <laughs> oh shit! You see this but shit. At the same time, though, you can you you saying you saying like numbers like that, but they gonna look at the influence and and they looking at the dollars it's gonna bring because you got LeBron and his son. But check this out though, influence your influence is only as good as the points that you put on the board, mm-hmm. man. 
Like even with being LeBron, at some point that shit ain't gonna be enough if you performing. What? How many points? They gonna put him out there to sell the tickets. Five point six. <laughs> hey, I'm talking <laughs> show. Listen, 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 listen five point six booth. points. That's, <laughs> nigga, that's five in the possible. Yeah, I like that's that. five in the possible, bro. We playing NBA. Come on, you want to go to the NBA with five in the possible? Hey, I go to the fucking but NBA game to you know, see my team win. You know, with uh, let's on 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 a more serious note. You know, he still go, he hasn't even been uh fully um You about to say the JJ shit. Go mm-hmm. ahead. I know. That's what I was looking at. Lil uh, bruh. What's the word I'm looking for? Recover. Or okay to he he's he on restricted minutes. Because mm-hmm. of what his because of the yeah, the the uh, the cardiac arrest. But the minutes that he that he he's able to play, he's not doing shit with him. I mean shit, he only playing like ten minutes. Nah, he had yeah, twenty he had more and they have that. no points. Yeah. Make that add up. He anywhere. played damn near half an hour out Make there. Make that add up anywhere. Uh, mm-hmm. And this this was several games. Mm-hmm. For for several games. They ain't a lot. The first two games. They were trying to the, defend this nigga for a long time. For the art, for the art. Listen, for the no no to, listen, me, listen to me. Mm-hmm. For the sake of argument, I would go back and forth with this nigga about this shit. Mm-hmm. But after like the third time we had a time, I'm like, all right, man, the gig is up, man. Yeah. Dude, this ain't it. I'm yeah, sorry. Man. Like, you know what I mean? Like, I don't even think it's a worth calling JJ today. You want to call? You don't. Mm-mm. Yeah, because at this point it's bullying. I will see JJ in a minute. <laughs> this point is bullying. <laughs> harassment. He ain't been on. The, <laughs> he ain't been on the upside of the argument since we started hey. discussing it. Mm. Last, last night he put up nine point six rebounds, a couple other stats, and and helped help lead the team to victory. So maybe maybe he's gonna. His daddy called him like. Maybe hey. he just had a a couple bad. Cut that, hey, cut that shit out. That nigga going back to USC next year, he going to try again. Oh, yeah, probably. That's what's going to happen. He ain't coming this to the This is his league. freshman year, nah, though, right? Yeah. 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 He, he I, think, I think I, I think he, I think he, it, uh, because of what happened, uh, the events of, of what happened. You don't even have confidence in the shit you're saying. Let me be I, honest. Say, you don't I, sound I, like you believe I'm nothing just, that's I'm about stuttering. to come out your the mouth whole, right the, now, bro. Because the whole thing is, right, I'm trying to take in account of the situation that happened to him. And because he's not 100% himself, I'm he can't do that. what. So if he, so with the help, <laughs> with, with rest and with health, mm-hmm. come next season, he might be a little bit more than what he's shown us this year. Take this out, right? So that's why I'm saying maybe next year. But again, that's all because I mean, but you can't you can't exclude. He said, if he, still, he got like, half a lung, lung out there, goddamn it, he's still. If they allowing this nigga to play. I'm not trying to hear none of them excuses. None of what happened back before the season started. None man, of that y'all going at it, man, shit. y'all. Y'all really, y'all really, y'all really, ping, shit. pow, pow, pow. You y'all got me? some points, baby. Yeah, I, it's like, bro, I feel you. I feel you. God damn it. Like, well, you feel me? Like, real. If, <clears throat> if he, he, he being medically clear, he wouldn't be out there. I'm not, what you said really don't apply because. I mean, why wouldn't it? It ain't no different from a motherfucker that got a, 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 a ankle injury or some old shit. They mm-hmm. wouldn't let him play if his ankle mm-hmm. wasn't ready. But I'm. But if, you know, you know, they still gonna make that excuse court, for him. You know, some players play timid. That's listen, on, they they play with the con- they play with on their man. One, <laughs> listen, <laughs> bro, I'm gonna get hurt again. Bro, so they don't. Be, listen, they don't you be caping. Where they used to be. You caping. Mm-hmm. Take no, your cape off. Yes, mm-hmm. you are. Because if you weren't able to go out and perform, they you wouldn't let, let you go out and perform. You missing what I'm. You missing what? Listen to what I'm saying. That's on paper. If I clear you to play, mm-hmm. it's different than your mindset and your mentality on the court. Exactly. If you have an ankle injury and I clear you to play, but does me clear you have to do with your ability to play? Listen, when you get in the studio, when you ain't been in the studio for a minute, you got to get some get some 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 studio dust off of you, right? How many songs is it gonna take before you back in pocket and you back? How many? How long, dude? Nigga, how many games has yeah. this nigga played? Because we about ten games in. Come on, man. At this point, you just and this highest was fifteen, and we talking about a well, not a draft pick anymore. But we was talking about a he was a first round yeah, first projected round. first round draft pick. Just and based this nigga off the hit twenty points yet. In a game, <coughs> I, at some point what? you got to quit giving a nigga the. I, I give him. I give him some more time, man. Because he he, he if made it. Listen, if point. he he got to come back to USC, 
He can't. Oh just yeah, go no, to the, no, hell no. Nah. He, he is not ready for the league. league. I can, he, no, he, sir. No. No, he what about a G League? league. No, nope. no, not even that. No, he not even ready not even in that. college. Yeah, he, he got stay, to prove. He's still he, playing at a high school. He got school to prove that. Yeah, yeah he's still playing at high school he's still level. Playing he got with man. basically kids. Mm -hmm. You got to prove yourself there first. That's for sure. You feel me? I will and say, you can't even average double digits. I will say that JJ was right because he has definitely improved since then. Back to back zero point games. <laughs> <laughs> he said there was room for improvement. Yeah, absolutely. Yeah. You know, I mean, it ain't nowhere to go. But up for ain't nowhere to go. Yeah, yeah. Yeah. That was my argument to begin with, right? Yeah. Mm -hmm. But he hasn't improved enough. Enough. It just ain't enough improvement. Yeah, not enough I mean, to switch shit. the league. Look, yeah, his his all of his shooting percentage. No, I'm low. saying I, like I mean shit. <laughs> what you about to say? <laughs> if he been cleared to play, bro, he need to be out there busting his ass like he was doing. I mean, he, from the and, get go, and, and like it's he, that, ain't, but he what was if he, never doing it. What you mean from the get go? That's what I'm saying. Was, like he got the same never, effort going on. The nigga was never balling. Which way did this come from? You can't see when you see when you. The nigga was never really balling. His yeah. name just got him through everywhere to where he at. Yeah. You know, nerd thing. That's why we even talking about this fucking bum. That's why I'm, <laughs> that's my whole point. Is why I'm angry that we talk that we talk about this nigga. So listen, yeah, nah. this is the last I don't time. know if no, I don't know if I ever said this or not, but everything that everybody says is solely their opinion and their opinion on <laughs> LeBron James. <laughs> At no point in time during this conversation have you heard me disrespect you or your family, sir. So later on in the future, <laughs> when we become a big platform, if you want to come and sit down with me or anybody else from Everybody Has One, or you me. are more than welcome. Bronny, if you want to come sit down and debate your stats <laughs> with me, we can do this. You know what I'm saying? If you want to come, you know? if you want to come see me about what I said, come sit down with us. Nah, nah, I feel like I got real beef <laughs> with said, no, said, no, <laughs> If you have a problem with something that he said, go holla at him. Refer to what I said in the beginning. That is solely his opinion. All right. On the YouTube side. <laughs> funny as fuck, bro. All right, so listen. Let's talk about R&B niggas. Mm. Why do it seem oh, like man. these niggas is more violent than the drill rappers. Because they are. They, yeah. they always have been. Can I be honest? But it's one, it's, it's one nigga that I really feel like is the, the new school bad boy R&B. And that nigga name is Trey Songs. Every time this yeah. nigga Trey Songs go somewhere, he, done he get into on, a scuffle. His name Trigger, baby. <laughs> oh, there you go. And it's name? always over a girl. Mm-hmm. Yeah. It never fits. <laughs> mm -hmm. So 50 Cent has something called Tycoon Weekend. It's like a big ass festive event. They go down in like Houston, Texas, I believe. I think that's where he didn't move to. So he had this event and all the celebrities come out. It's a big thing. Mm. At the last event, Trey Songs was up there fooling and fighting. And this nigga done got banned from all future Tycoon Weekends. Like wow. 50 Cent said, that little nigga can't come back. <laughs> so... Jaquees and Trey Songs was at an at, at an event recently. And I can't really remember the specifics, but I know they got into a physical altercation. So Jaquees posted a picture of some of his dreads. Not in his head, by the way. And he says, This nigga, he said, hold on, I'm sorry. Fuck Trey Songs. That nigga can't come back to Atlanta. This nigga came in the club and said, I got on a Q fit, LOL. Whole time nigga hating. This man dancing, introducing himself to niggas, all type of shit. Bitch ass nigga, and I gave that bitch ass nigga a compliment. Man, fuck you, pussy. You a hoe boy. <laughs> that love be fake. Mm. And them boys wasn't and them boys wasn't me, boy. You over there with in the A. What? Oh, mm. listen. Dude sound like he from Trotwood. I don't really. I was about to say that's but the, Trotwood. But the just of it, Trey Songz was in that motherfucker hating, and they got into a physical altercation and snatched this nigga hair out. Which, how do y'all feel about R&B niggas and this energy that they displaying? 
They a nigga like ever pull my fake. hair, period. I'm going to shoot him. I'm not going to hold you, bro. They sound like they fake fuck. You pull my hair, I'm going to pop it. <laughs> <laughs> you said, say it again. You said what, bro? <laughs> say that again. Come again. They sound like they fake fucking. <laughs> Yeah, that, I mean, like a domestic dispute. Yeah, <laughs> like, that's exactly what this was. <clears throat> but Jacquees <throat> trying to make it gangster. He can't come Jack- back to Atlanta. Nah, yeah, he Jack- can't come mm. back. He can't like come back to the house. Like he did say, nigga running around dancing, introducing yeah, himself to niggas. Himself. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> like, uh-huh. so, hey, Jacquees, like certain motherfuckers, you just look at like. A fucking joke. And <clears throat> like, sir, okay, like, okay, I'm Trey Songs, Chris Brown. Two of them niggas, I'd be like, okay, them niggas, he ain't just no singing ass nigga. You said the two out of the tri- I'm no, no he, he's, I'm, I'm, he's I'm, using I'm those two as example. an example when you right. see them, you'd you be see, like, when you mm-hmm. see them, when you, you know what I'm saying? Like, when you, they on real nigga time. Mm-hmm. But they just, some singing they just ass sing. niggas. Mm-hmm. They just sing. Jacquees don't give me. I'm one of them. He yeah. one of them type of, mm-hmm. uh, but I'm a singing ass nigga type. He mm-hmm. one of them. I'm a singer. Yeah. Like, first. Yeah. <laughs> I'm a singer first, man. Like, if I, like a nigga, like if, <laughs> like if a nigga, nigga, nigga slap that nigga, bro, like he going to be the ones that. Security. It's going to be that one. He's not because he holding on to his pride. There's that long tear that's just dropping shit like. He ain't gonna do nothing. He, he just accepted. Do not. He's gonna accept it. You letting your you letting your pride just come. He he not even gonna like get mad dove. at the nigga that smacked him. He gonna get mad at the niggas that was with him that let him smack. Him. <laughs> not <letting laughs> motherfuckers get so close. And he's so little, he would literally be just like that, looking up like like that's what I'm saying. Like so, certain people is just I'm normal, and we can't get beside the we can't out think or not forget the, forget the fact that. These niggas are niggas. They men. Yeah. yeah. They just sing to females. Mm-hmm. You know. And we the ones that be singing they shit too, though. You know the 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 R and B nigga that had me fooled, who I thought was one of them, and then I realized that he wasn't. No. Oh. August Alcina. Oh man, yeah. That nigga he had me thinking he was one of them one type of New yeah. Orleans niggas. Because he fucked Jada. Until like. Tory Lanez smacked that nigga and then went. <laughs> Remember that picture he sent out where he was in the elevator like this, like <laughs> victim photo, like he looked like a victim, bitch ass nigga. Yeah, so That's your boy. August Alcina had me, uh, had me, he had me full, and then I think he came out that he got a boyfriend now or something like oh, that. Oh damn, he, yeah, and that just warning. happened. That just happened within the last like year mm-hmm. or so. Damn, bro, damn. how y'all think, bro? That shit is. That's some weird shit. He had probably some of the what do we think most was? fantasized pussy ever. How the fuck y'all think Will Smith feel about like, bro? <laughs> Chill. What's that? Don't worry, I'll be ready. That, that, <laughs> Hollywood. Bad, what's the thing he done had, did? Me, had me on. Had me out there talking about this fucking talk? entanglement <laughs> and shit. Uh, nah, but yeah. nah, nigga. And Will then, Smith got a boyfriend. Yeah, allegedly. Say, allegedly. Allegedly. Hey, maybe but that's why he was person, all right. The with first him. person who he once was, man. Maybe he, he was getting entangled too. So how you think? <laughs> how, he, how you think he got where he at in Hollywood? On there, that, that nigga, nigga comfortable. What can Williams say? That Boy, nigga booty ain't no virgin. Hey, he would have got let Will Smith have shown an inkling of anger. Dwayne Martin would have cussed him out. Nigga, I know you still ain't mad over this Jada shit. That's his boyfriend. Mm-hmm. <laughs> Allegedly. 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 Yeah. I it broke my heart. I for years I was in denial about Will Smith being gay. Cause I my mama my mama God bless her soul, my mama was a fresh print like was a fresh print. Oh, she fresh loved it. Bel Air. Mm-hmm. what? <laughs> hey, me too. What? I fuck with. Then when I got to doing music and shit, she was like, "Baby, when you gonna rap like Will Smith? When you ain't gonna be cussing and all that? Mm-hmm. You know what I mean? What?" <laughs> So I'm saying, you know, I'll, I'll, cause I'll, in my mind, I'm like, I can't. Not cuss. I, yeah, you feel me? Mm-hmm. <laughs> <laughs> <I'm, laughs> mama, I'm gonna make this what happen. But so, like, when I, that shit was crazy, bro. But 
the reality of that shit is, man, the Fresh Prince is not who he once was, bro. That's a fact. And for however long that is, I don't know, but he's 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 not it, bro. When you not think it. when you think that shit switched. Shit, I ain't gonna lie to you. I'm gonna hey, <laughs> with movie? me being with with shit his first movie. <laughs> Yeah, that's what I heard too. I ain't I never saw it. You yep. said his first movie. His first yep. movie. Getting fucked and everything. Was in the what in that little uh horse and carriage with dude. Yeah, it's kissing. like an old western or some shit. Nah, it ain't no west. Ain't no western. Nah, it ain't no Wild western. Wild West? His first so you gotta think <laughs> look like he was all he was, you gotta think his revolutionary time ass movie. It was shit. it was Early eight, eight. I'm about to look. Eight, Chuck, eight, look at look at Will Smith's first movie, man. I thought it was Independence late, Day. No, nah. hell no. Nah. nah, he was nah, young. He late, got, late he was, eight, his first movie was like late eighties. This early nigga, 90s. he said it was like a western. The nigga said, "Wow, wow, wow." I don't remember that. In well, no, well. I said it like that because I was in disbelief. Like I know this ain't the movie y'all talking about. Yeah, yeah nah. so I was like, "Wow, wow, west." Nah. Yeah, nah. <laughs> My nigga was gangster in Wild Wild West, man. Yeah. Wild Wild West, Jim West, Desperado, <laughs> Rough Rider. Oh, you don't want nada. You hear me? Gunning this. Yeah. Gunning this. <laughs> 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 Buffalo Soldier, just like hey, I thought. This was this, this was the most player shit I ever heard Will Smith say. Any damsel that's in distress, just call Jim West. She be out of that dress. <laughs> no, look, but this is the hardest shit. This is the hardest shit I ever heard him say. Don't let your lip react. You don't want to see my hand where my hip be at. <laughs> I said, this nigga Will Smith said he <laughs> I'll smack the fuck out of him, man. Hey, what the fuck is wrong with Will? Hey, man. Better reckon, he said, you better recognize. <laughs> <laughs> Have you ever been listening to some shit when you got older, like something would come on the radio, and you'd be like, damn, damn you just said that. <clears throat> don't let your lip react. You don't want to see my hand yeah. where my hip be. <laughs> my boy went platinum, man. Y'all better quit playing. A couple my times, boy. Sure. he the goat rapper yeah. to go. Uh, I, ain't yeah. gonna, I ain't gonna lie to you though, but he's still one of the most slept on rappers. Yeah, yeah, for sure. I for give sure. him that. Yeah. Chuck, did you like, get a name you know of that movie? On the Is it where the day I'm takes you. Uh, that that I might be so. it. Yeah, that's the first uh, movie. What year did he come out? Uh, nineteen ninety. Two? I believe that. That might yeah, be that it. Like it's the latest movie. Early 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 yeah. That sounds like some bullshit profile. I ain't never watched. I mean, yeah. I seen it on a clip one time. And you got to think, though, right? I was born in 91. So let's start let, Let's start there. Yeah. <laughs> he said, let's start there. <laughs> shit hit different. All right, so say what you're going to say. We're going to wrap this topic up and get to another one. Go ahead, bro. That shit just be like what well, they say... Your sacrifices for fame and fortune and all that shit. Oh. That's just, you know what I'm saying? You look at the man's career, it's just it's crazy after that. Like, right after that, my nigga, it had to be been motherfucking uh, Fresh Prince. Mm hmm. Fresh Prince was it? Fresh Prince. 1990 and, to 1996, it says. Mm hmm. 1990 to 90. So, come on. He was already doing it. He was all, he's already mm -hmm. doing it, but. Mm -hmm. To sacrifice though, you might get a little taste of it before you gotta give it up. Mm -hmm. You know what I'm saying? Or you gonna do this before we give it to you? That's how the industry go. That's though. how it be, bro. However, uh, it, however it is, or it could have been. Get what they or want it could have been. We know you cool with this, so come on over this way. Yeah, that should be freaky. Anyway, proceed, brother. All right, I'm about to um, <laughs> read this article to y'all, man. It says Pennsylvania man arrested after allegedly killing his father. And displaying his decapitated head on YouTube. Damn, damn, In the man. video, which has been removed, Justin Moan says his father was a federal employee and refers to him as a traitor while voicing right wing conspiracy theories. Mm. Right wing? So, right, Cons that's Republicans. Okay. The left are considered Democrats, mm. DOJs are considered. Gotcha. Democrats. So so his pops was a fed. Yeah. When he smoked him and showed his head. He decapitated it. Yeah. Cut he that shit. Yeah, I'm gonna say he cut this shit off. He headed that nigga. And the video was on and YouTube for like six hours. Y'all ain't let me finish my it. rhyme. See, that's how much uh, you tell me it's a bar. Crazy. Give us like some type of Damn. 
Say some rapper shit like check me. Uh, nah, cause it was just Hold a, on. a smooth uh, one. Give me like a uh. It was a smooth one. Nice. Yeah, I'm, I'm, go ahead. Off with his head. Mm -mm -mm. That's crazy. Fuck twelve. Mm -hmm. <laughs> the uh, the video he posted, he was holding his dad's head up, ranting about Biden. So dudes just wound up off the internet. Too many Facebook groups or something. Like Ranting that. about Biden is crazy with your daddy's hand in your head. Hey, we yeah. gotta we should have been <laughs> friends clips. It was up for six hours before anybody took it down. Ooh. How many views did it get? <laughs> yeah, how shit. many people saw, actually saw that? Yeah, I know that oh man, I know a lot of people saw that shit. Man. I'm about to find it. Yeah, I know <laughs> that motherfucker went crazy. Oh yeah, you know a website to go to to find hey. it too. That's wild, man. I just, I can't even, I still don't believe it. Like, that, that sounds like some whole made up shit to me. All over your uh, political beliefs. Bruh. I mean, shit, at this point, niggas, day and age, motherfuckers dying for less and cheaper. That shit only happened overseas, dude. <laughs> 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 like, I ain't never, hey, they acting crazy. Yeah. That's a, that's a little bit too far fetched for me, man. Yeah, that's just some shit. I would just like you. You can't even come up with no same reason, no no series of events as to why this shit even happened. Like this. <laughs> man, what is the world coming to? Rajon Rondo's <laughs> mug shot released after he was arrested on gun and drug charges in Indiana. Hey, man. According to reports, NBA champion Rajon Rondo was arrested in southern Indiana on a misdemeanor gun and drug charges after a traffic stop. Indiana State Police found a firearm and drug-related items in his Tesla following a reckless driving report. Rondo posted bond and was released. The juvenile in the vehicle was released to a family member. Shit, me and little cuz just riding around smoking a little bud. Smoking shit. a little purple on your don't shit. Don't hurt nobody. Shit. And nigga ain't gonna catch you slipping. <laughs> he said, you know, you know who I am, officer. <laughs> NBA champion, Ray John Rondo. You know what I, mean? well, I know you guys put us out <laughs> too many times. <laughs> hey, probably be over yeah, for him. Yeah, yeah. Indiana. He was in the wrong, was in the wrong sure. state to, to pull that because yeah. he's in Pacers, Pacers yeah. country talking about the Celtics. Yeah. Yeah. You know, yeah. and putting the ring in his yeah, face, yeah, though. You know what I mean? <laughs> like, damn, you just wearing that big motherfucker. <laughs> 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 he probably still had the button in his hand and everything. You, you, you found it? Uh, Get my registration. What was the dude who played for the Pacers? Oh shit, Ooh, Reggie Miller. Yeah, yeah. He's like he's sitting the cops and they're like, man, that's Reggie's ring. <laughs> <laughs> man, yeah, that's something else, man. I, I got to be more careful, Rondo. Mm -mm -mm. Out here getting little cuz in trouble. Now you got to you got to tell Auntie. You know what I'm saying? What's going on? Yep, little cuz. He ain't even want nobody to know he was smoking yet. God damn it. Shit. No, don't worry about it. I'm going to go and go deposit this 15000 into his uh, college yeah. fund. Yeah, I was just sure. rolling Shit, he, he went to auntie like, you, you'd rather hear him do it with me than somebody else out here. <laughs> <laughs> Facts. Facts. Here go 5000 You want to go shopping? I ain't really heard about no. That still um, made me mad, boy. No real athletes getting into a lot of trouble lately. Nobody but job. That's good. Except for that, what's his name? Kayshawn Boot? I ain't hip to my boy. Who, what, what, who, who did he play for? Who, who posted that there? He, uh, Chuck? He, I forget who he played for in the NFL, but he played at LSU and uh, they found his uh, his gambling account and he placed like 9,800 bets in a year. But guess what he on hit? Himself? His, get it, he guess. only bet on himself like. A few times, but he was betting on himself, yeah. But he was betting overs, so at mm. least he wasn't betting unders. But guess what he hit his name under? Yeah. Guess what he guess what his his ghost account name is? K Shine Boot Seven. Man, what <laughs> man this, he's, hey he said this seven gonna throw him off real good. 
<laughs> I'm hiding in plain sight. They would Man, never well. think I'm Kayshawn Boot betting on myself. Hey, that's the same as Vince putting a mustache on. That's Nobody crazy. can see me. Yeah. <laughs> 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 betting on themselves is crazy. Wow. He said, yeah, see? My place are bet, you see? <laughs> Put my whole paycheck on. <laughs> <You> never... <laughs> Damn, he did 9,000 bet. <laughs> he not even and supposed to be betting at all, is he? In a year. Yeah, he, no, he ain't supposed to be gambling he ain't at all. Be betting uh, at all. Yeah, it was mm-hmm. ridiculous. <laughs> but in a year, though? And he was in the negative, too. It's, it's not like he was winning money. He was losing? Yeah. Oh, dumb man. as fuck. Damn, he oh, got yeah, in trouble as fuck losing? now. Uh, now I don't even want to talk about him no more. Dumb as fuck. Yeah, that's that's pretty losing. much. That's, that's how you know you got a problem. Bro. How you lose and then get in trouble? You dumb as fuck. Hey, you how call, you bet on yourself and lose? You need to call that dumb hotline. as fuck. <laughs> yeah, how you <laughs> bet on yourself and lose? Like you dumb gotta, as fuck. He was better than betting against himself. He said, "What's up, motherfucker? <laughs> I hope you breaking these motherfuckers off in this motherfucker." <laughs> 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 oh shit. <laughs> <laughs> So, <laughs> oh, he played for the Patriots, Diego. Sorry, I played for the Patriots. You should have known about him, Diego. Damn, do your homework. <clears throat> ain't that your team? That's my team. All right, I was just making sure I ain't know. You know, we have enough bullshit going on with my team to be <laughs> right. We just to we be just, worried about we, some nigga getting away <laughs> with some shit. We just so had long. to get ready. We just had to get rid of our coach. <laughs> Yeah, yeah. Oh man, he got rid of himself. He it's a, it was time for it was time way. for him to go, yeah. but you know what I'm saying? We I'm happy about it. Oh shit, you a Patriots fan too, huh? Yeah, man. We rebuilding, man. We're going to get uh, more Bill, of Harris, Bill, so. Bill retired. Mm-hmm. Nah. Well, he trying to go to another team. Nah, I think he's he was trying to go to Atlanta damn near. Yeah, I'm about to say uh nah, I think they hired somebody already. Yeah, he's about to get left out. Yeah. He hired uh mm. <clears throat> yeah, but I did see that he had a meeting retire. with the Falcons. Yeah, he gonna fuck somebody. around and retire. Mm-hmm. Hmm. They said, "Come on, Bill, get they Bill, just, come, on, <laughs> come, come take this ten days. You know, go out as a Patriot." He said, "Look, you can come to the stadium anytime, but <laughs> <laughs> just, we got a chair for you. <laughs> just relax, buddy. Yeah, don't stand up and say nothing. Just chill." Yeah. <laughs> All the hors d'oeuvres you can handle. <laughs> um, I d- have y'all seen Krishan Rock lately? Man, you talking about a stupid face? Stupid Listen, face. I I don't understand. Blue face and stupid face. Why you mm. would get a face tattoo removed? Get it covered up on your neck, and then put it on yeah. your face. Mm. <laughs> I, just, I just don't get what would be the point uh, in that. Well, that's like one of hey, those animated characters on the video game. Right stuff. where he be smacking her ass at, too. That is a dangerous type of person because you could tell that she be doing shit on, like, um, on a whim. Yeah, it's not like thought out. You know what I mean? You That's the type of person to deal with because a motherfucker that'll do some shit like that on a whim. You don't know what to expect from them in a certain a heated argument or mm-hmm. like what? you know what I mean? Yeah, too sporadic. Yeah, mm-hmm. she fuck around, kid. Just random. That's the worst kind of toxicity. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. Yeah, if I can't tell what you thinking like that, yeah, he said, "Boy, I'm nervous, boy. I got to go." I'm just gonna fuck. That's wild, kill dude in his sleep. You remember when she cut her? <laughs> you remember she broke in his house, stole his kit, stole his car, and wrote some shit in blood on his wall, and mm. drove like yeah, yeah like saying. 500 miles away to a whole nother state, and then she was cl- went to jail, and then you know what happened <laughs> next? This nigga went and got her out of jail. Went, went and he fucking said, got her. He said she's a witch. <laughs> boy, it's up, boy. She's no. a witch. <laughs> I don't understand, like. Why we watch people uh, crash out and female like females really be like cheering this shit on like really love this girl and go back to what bro was saying what we was talking about <coughs> earlier niggas don't be playing over that motherfucker <laughs> over that yeah man, he went to get his bitch boy nigga that's it fuck with the. the However, I portray it all on the internet yeah. and all on the TV. What's going on in real life? 
I love I my baby mama. I never let him go. Would you? Do you think you could still deal with somebody that do all of that? What that old extra shit? Yeah. This shit, when is it? The dick ball. Dick falling straight off the bone ball. <laughs> been, been, been in the crock pot for oh, twelve man. hours. Ooh, <laughs> yeah, marinated and sauteed. <laughs> oh, That's funny. Man. I ain't did Whip that yet. I've been holding on to that for a bit. Hey man, give me some, man. You <laughs> my nigga. We've been doing that since he was locked up, man. laughing that shit. Oh, That's man, funny. Hey, tender dick ball. Dick, 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 <laughs> dick falling straight off the bone. <laughs> been in the crock pot for twelve hours. Real yeah. marinated and serenaded. <laughs> 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 I would. I couldn't do that. I was, can y'all see? Do Do you think you uh love somebody enough to get like a face tattoo of them? I've loved enough to get the name tatted. So let her. I mean, yeah, yeah. I can see you. You can see on yourself your getting a face on your face. Now, oh. n- not on my face. <laughs> I, I am. Face I ain't, on me. But I didn't like. But just in general. I can't see it because we love enough to get a name. We, you know what I'm saying, or something symbolic to whoever we are emotionally tied to, or have some type of connection to. So I can see it, but on my face, it's not my choice. You name, uh, not necessarily on your face, but I ain't got no tattoos, baby. I ain't, you ain't got to worry hey, about man. me, hey, baby. Hold on, wait, hold on, wait. Stop the shit, press. Man. That's crazy. Stop the mm-hmm. press. Never. Check my nigga out with this shirt, boy. Hey, I ain't Never. gonna lie. You fucked him up today, gang. Yeah, you know. You fucked him up today, gang. Oh, my nigga came through. Hey. It's cut different, baby. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> I forgot I even made that. That's yeah. hard. I told Jeff I had it in the vault for. That's a bad one. Since the move, goddammit. Yeah. Yeah, you got that off. So you the ninety, you the you the you the uh ninety thousand bus down plain Jane, <laughs> other 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 yeah. other other pod big plain Jane. Oh, yeah, yeah, we bust him down. We 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 do we. No. He came he came uh, slight fresh today with the cut different shit on, but he normally come with five thousand dollar jacket. Mm-hmm. Nah, <laughs> <laughs> mm-hmm. yeah, then man. nigga be walking around this like, yeah, I smell money, and this yeah. nigga pop. Be do 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 do. Then be do. Hey, you got that off. I ain't gonna lie to you. Appreciate it, brother. Then be do. Um, he said it be do. <laughs> <laughs> but what was we talking about? Oh, the face tattoo. Yeah, the face tattoos. But I I uh. I don't agree with what what that lady did, and <laughs> hell no, nah, I wouldn't get one for myself. <clears throat> Not at no. all. Like nobody face on you nowhere. Nope, nobody's face name, none of that. I get a name. Not on my face. Yeah, I mean, you know, I I. Cause you could turn the name into whatever you want to. I like to see. Uh, I like to see tats created. You know what I mean. I appreciate the artwork, but mm-hmm. just not for me. Yeah, turn the shit yeah, into a Draco. <laughs> <laughs> turn turn her name into a fucking uh, a katana blade. <laughs> you know what I mean. Mm-hmm. Cover that shit up. Turn her into a Dragon Ball. <laughs> Man, I can't believe it. I still can't believe. See, when I first saw that. Uh, when I first saw the post, I thought it was fake. Like I thought it was fake news. Like this girl done got that man's face tatted on her for real. I didn't think it was fake because she did it twice already. That bitch don't play no game. And got his That's government cool. name tattooed on her. Jonathan, big as fuck. <laughs> oh, what? Just mm-hmm. love this nigga. Yeah. Certified. Yeah, she <laughs> she loved the put a stamp on it. <laughs> and this, I never. This is the uh, blue, blue face, face nigga. And the Krishan. He knocked her. Ain't, ain't, yeah, he knocked her too. He knocked yeah. her tooth out or some shit, right? He knocked her daddy out, didn't she? Didn't he? Yeah. Pieced he, him up. He pieced yeah. his ass like, like, damn. Real quick. Her daddy hey, deserved it. Knock her yeah, daddy he out. did that shit. <laughs> he did deserve that, that shit. Hey, y'all <clears> keep <throat> forgetting about how her daddy almost knocked Blueface out now. He's just lucky the little 
the wall was behind him or he nah. was going down when he was hitting him. Like, huh, huh. He caught him with the blue face almost went down, but the wall saved him. Uh-huh. And then he woke he up. Tried no, to he get away. He's <laughs> yeah, had him yeah. leaking. Mm. But that, man, that shit was just right. Like entertainment. Yeah. Mm-mm. All that for the fame, yeah, boy. Fucking face thing. tattoo. Yeah, yeah it's yeah, a lot of I, shit. Like fucking face tattoo. Yeah, for that sure. Be that bullshit. All right, so I need to know what's your sign. Even if you get rich, what is your sign? Like my zodiac. Astral- uh, okay, um, Aquarius. What's your sign? Gemini. Libra. Gemini. Aquarius. It sound like the B2K song. Hey, my name is Raz. <laughs> <laughs> no, and, and I'm a. All right, but look, check this out. Did y'all know this? During research, scientists discovered that four signs, Pisces, Cancer, Sagittarius, and Scorpio, account for almost 40% of serial killers. (laughs) 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 On the other hand, serial killers born under the sign of Capricorn had the highest number of victims in total. They killed more than 800 people. The analysis also discovered that Pisces, Cancer, Sagittarius, and Scorpio dominated the list, mm, mm-hmm. with each of these zodiac signs accounting for 46 serial killers. As a whole, the mentioned signs contribute to 38% of all serial killers in the research. What, what That don't sound like none of y'all nigga signs was in here. Nah, man, that's that psycho drama shit. Except I ain't. mine. Except yours. <laughs> he said except mine. <laughs> that's the psycho drama shit. <laughs> I saw that. I said that's crazy. That's yeah, deep. That is deep as fuck. Yeah, that's a hell of a stat right there. <laughs> I just touch it. Hey, you do be ready to crash much, out sometimes. How much of the world's population is, be chill. has a mental defect? <laughs> chill. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, I be chill. I be chill. All right, I'll bro, no, for sure. I, I got a question for everybody. Do y'all think black people can be racist? Absolutely. Yeah. I think everybody's racist. Yeah. Mm-hmm. mm-hmm. Me too, bro. Chuck, you think black people can be racist? I think everybody is. <laughs> I think it's in the human DNA to be slightly racist without the intention to. Mm-hmm. Okay. Like, um, it's called tribalism or whatever. Talk mm-hmm. to them, Chuck. Like, when yeah. people don't, when you don't look the same, your instincts automatically have something to say about that, I guess. No. But I always say that we're at a point me, in society and the where we are aware enough to where we can we don't have to act on it just yeah. because it's there. Let, you know what I mean? Let me side bar on that, man. Okay, so at my job I work around it is real diverse, all right? You know what I mean? You black people, white people, French, Spanish, Mexican Dominican, all all kind of walks of life, you know what I mean? And like, we all joke on each other for real, you know what I'm saying? And it don't even necessarily be like, like the old racist joke, but like we just make fun of a how each other talk and shit like that, you know mm-hmm. what I mean? Which is slightly racist, you feel me? Racism. But it, but it, it's, it's in everybody. Like I said, I think everybody's racist, you know what I mean? And shit. Me too, bro. Everybody's it, definitely. All right, so what is racist? What does racism consist of to you? Repeat that again. What does racism <laughs> consist of to you? Uh, like, what qualifies uh, under racism? Like being racist? Just okay. What qualifies as being racist? I would say to disregard. Uh, make fun of um, <clears throat> or how could I say um, it's another word that I'm looking for but I think you get what I'm yeah. saying but any any derogatory offend it, yeah I wouldn't even say offend because like I said you could be joking with each other you know what I'm saying in a sense so uh, it's just a it's just a realm of uh, it's an umbrella of things that you know what I mean that that requires a racist, I would say. So, so. <coughs> what do y'all think uh, is the difference between racism and 
prejudice. Now that's the part that I don't like and I don't agree with because, and I do think it's a difference. Uh, the prejudice part is where it's like, I believe <clears throat> where you just hate this person, you know what I'm saying? And it's just, uh, like it's a, it's a the same stuff that you guys joke about mm -hmm. a prejudice motherfucker stand on and yeah. really be on that type not yeah. this is like they really be on the uh like the shit that now, you joke about they really mean to, to offend yeah type type yeah, shit. yeah yeah they want to hurt no your joke. feelings yeah it really ain't racist let's, they yeah really, <clears throat> so let's really gonna treat you different we really believe i'm a better you feel me? Mm -hmm. Yeah, that way. Let's real so let's get an I understanding really, of what prejudice is. Prejudice is um It's the hating race. It's 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 disliking a group of people or whatever <clears throat> for reason and call uh without cause. Well look looking it up. Mm-hmm. Prejudice files under racism. All right. It says okay. characterized by or showing prejudice, discrimination, or antagonism against a person or people on the basis of their membership in a particular racial or ethnic group, typically one that is minority or marginalized. We are investing complaints about racist abuse. Okay. And that's why I asked you if you feel like um, black people could be racist because... <clears throat> Like, when do you ever really hear about Mexicans and black people not getting along outside of whenever they're in prison? I got a cool. I'm cool mm -hmm. as fuck with a with with a couple different Mexicans. You feel me? Yeah. Or when do you ever hear like black people being racist towards Chinese people? And like, can you be racist towards a white person? Do I mean, you feel like you could be racist towards a white person? They the common denominator though. No, that's know. what I was asking because um I don't never really remember a time in history where white people were the oppressed. Yeah. yeah. Everything everything that they had every everything that hmm. that um the uh that the I don't wanna really wanna say white people, so I'm gonna say Caucasian. It just sounds more educated. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, go ahead. Uh, but anything that they have came in contact with or whatever, they were the bottom denominator. They dominated. <clears throat> yeah. They they took and flipped or whatever. That's just like you know what I'm saying. Think about how Britain on on the on the global scale, right? You got this piece of land that is like this, right? And it's called Britain. And Britain owns damn near every piece of land on earth. If you think about it, more than any other country. Mm -hmm. See, and I only ask that because I personally have never had like a bad like feeling towards another color or anything like that. You feel yeah, me? It ain't, yeah, it wasn't real. I look at Chuck like family now. You mm -hmm. feel me? Yeah. My sister, <laughs> my sister Shana is white. You mm -hmm. know what I mean? And I don't know if black do like, when black, do black people see other people and be like, ooh, I don't like them because they're this. You feel me? Mm -hmm. Like, have you ever felt like you, like a group of black people were like against you? <clears throat> I mean, not for any personal reason, but I mean, there's definitely been situations where, you know, I felt like I wasn't fitting in. I've had, I've been walking down the street, had people tell me to get out of the neighborhood I was in before, but that ain't really. I mean, that no, ain't, I'm not saying that ain't nothing for me to, you know, yeah. say anything nothing. about. You know, what yeah, I mean? it's, it's yeah, just no, but part of life. but even right. that, I'm surprised by. Like well, I've I mean, never. I, I, I I was I wasn't hanging out in Kettering and shit, you know. Mm -hmm. I, I was I was walking home from work down Oak Ridge over over off of Gettysburg. 
Yeah, no, yeah, I felt like I was in the wrong was. neighborhood and told mm-hmm. me about it. <laughs> oh, okay. Yeah. <laughs> oh, that, it was just a question. I, it was a conversation that me and my girl had the other day. So I thought I would bring that to the floor and see. Yeah, man. Yeah, I ain't gonna lie. I'm thinking about it. Like I like if I don't like somebody, I don't like them because of. Yeah, it's not gonna Damn. be them. It's yeah. more black it's people not, I don't like. Right it's now. not more. It's like, not more. Hey, that's a I nice don't like ass them hat because. Too. Something mm-hmm. like nice because they nice looked nice this way or they, yeah, you know what I'm saying? It's, it's about the, what they did exactly, That's their behavior, <clears throat> yeah, you know and they the content of their character. You know what yeah, I mean? you feel me? So, nah, because I got all color type of friends. Yeah. yeah, if it's if it's been anybody, whether it be whether it be black, white, or indifferent, the only time I felt like something. Like felt a type of way towards them. It's always been in defense. Like they've done something to me to make me feel mm-hmm. some type of way. Now I feel some way towards you specifically, not you, but it's always you as a person and not <coughs> you as a people. Yeah, you feel me? yeah. Right. yeah. yeah. Right. So yeah. that's why I was asking because I don't never really remember it being a time where. Me and a couple of my people then seen like a white person walk by and we just felt like getting on their ass because they was walking down the street. That's why I was surprised by by that. You see what I'm saying? Mm-hmm. See, with us, with, with us, we don't own, like with us, we actually are individual type of people. But when it comes to Caucasians, they're the only group of people that we be like, how they how they look at it, how on the racial on the racial scale, how they say them people, how they don't individualize mm-hmm. us, they categorize us as one as you know what I'm saying. Mm-hmm. Everybody, that's how we do them. I ain't gonna lie, I ain't, and but this, with anybody, but with anybody, any at other race though, mm-hmm. it, it would be an individual type of thing, not those people. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. <laughs> yeah, I feel you, bro. All right, great pod, everybody. We done reached the 135 mark. Uh, what you got? Was, yeah, for sure. That's what I was looking at. Like what you, nah, nah like, I know nah, what you I was swear. looking at. What you, you, you? Keep it G. I was looking at that and saw that. Yeah, all right. What you got going on, Hefe? <laughs> hey, man. Uh, I just came up with a new idea, so I got a surprise for my, for my concert people, for people who follow me, who watch. Uh, man, nothing, man, just working. That's what it do. Right. One more time, tell them where they can find your content, man. Tell no, how wait, listen. Don't be having me how you plug this shit if you ain't gonna actively be on there turning. That hey. motherfucker better turn into a transformer three months from now, <laughs> and I better be able to see it on TikTok. Hey, it's gonna, hey, it's definitely. I want a ride. Fuck you mean? I need a ride somewhere. I definitely got He's shit. He's somewhere. Yeah, I don't know where. <laughs> where you got to go, bro? We work, big dog. Where you got to go, bro? But yeah, you yeah. can find me on TikTok, <laughs> Hefe937, J-E-F-E underscore 937. No. Hmm? That's something yeah. different. Did he say no? They find it. Hey, they find it. <laughs> 397. <laughs> okay. It's 397 or 392. What is it? Nah, oh, it's shit. 392, man. What you got going yeah, I'm on? High, go? <laughs> I'm, <laughs> high, I'm high, man. I'm high, man. He high, man. What you got going on? Half 392, go? man. Man, I'm high. I don't know what the fuck I got going on. Correcting me, he obviously, motherfucker. Hey. He, he said, <laughs> 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 you know? Got shit going on, man. One day at a time. What about you? What you got going on? You know, on the road again. <clears throat> I gotta go pick my goddamn sprinter van. I'm gonna need a ride after this, man. I'm gotta go pick up my sprinter van. Uh, I ain't got shit going on though. Working and potting. Working and potting. That's it. Yeah. Mm-hmm. Man, I'm about to. Uh... He said, "Yep." Like I was speaking for the both of us. Like <laughs> what he said. <laughs> <laughs> well, uh. About to get this hair done, you know what I mean? I just had to cover it up for y'all today, you feel me? Just boy looking rough, you feel me? Holler at brother Dave, you know what I'm talking about? I think it's about to come crazy for Valentine's Day. Man, look, I had to snip my own mustache and everything today. God damn it. I, 
Hey, Dave, come holler at careful, your boy. Be, be careful with that shit. You see him back, baby. You <laughs> see, <laughs> see him back, baby. <laughs> but, uh, getting ready for that uh, Mike Epps, Lil Duval. <coughs> all all them, all them guys. I'm going to Columbus. You going to Columbus? Yep. Okay. Yep, check them out. And shoot, get the weekend off. I would said, fuck work. Shit, they going to have to figure it out. God damn it. Yeah. And that's that. Yo, oh, Black, what bro. you got going on, bro? Shit, man. Like I said earlier, man, it's up with me, man. I'm doing it. I, I do the same shit repeatedly, man, every day, all day, man. I chase a dollar, man. Yeah. You know I mean? Straight simple to the point. Straight simple to the point, man. You work on some music or something, man. Try and, you know, like I said, uh, put things in perspective, man. You know what I'm saying? On the more positive note, more legal side of things, you know what I'm saying? Clear my name up and trying to fly straight, man, so... You know what I'm saying? Amen. Hey, it's just it's a it's a process, but <clears throat> it's progress. You gotta go through it to get to it, baby. Yeah, for sure. Mm-hmm. That's a fact. Mm-hmm. Chuck, what you got going on? Like I said, I'm in financial recovery, so <laughs> I'm working. I like the way he say that. Financial <laughs> recovery. And, uh, <laughs> my birthday's this weekend, so I'm hoping that. Uh, hey. What you doing for your birthday, man? Thanks, Chuck. He says shit. Well, we got to turn check up it's for on, the It's on Saturday, so I might be podding. I don't know. Oh, yeah. We got oh, yeah. We, oh, yeah we, we, we going yeah. down we after pod. somewhere after pod. Yeah, we going <laughs> a big Now, don't start laughing. We going somewhere after pod. Right. We let you know All right now. We going right. somewhere after All pod. Right. All right. Oh, All right. Fuck around, go bowling. <laughs> so, y'all trying to go bowling? Yeah, we taking Chuck to the club. He fuck you talking about? Strip club. I don't go out, but I'm going out next week. Yeah. Take him to Sugars. Yeah, for sure. Big bottle. Sugars be lit, especially when they be having a stripper mm-hmm. night. All time. All right, man. Great pod, everybody. You know, everybody has an opinion. Mm-hmm. Everybody has an asshole, mm-hmm. and everybody has a podcast. Mm-hmm. Just it's not this podcast. podcast. This was everybody has one, <clears throat> and tonight we leaving out with the real Dre Cash. Last time I checked, let's go. Got the black, let me hit the black. Love free over here, goddammit. Last time I checked, shit, I've been hot. Last time I checked out the same nigga from V Block.
Last time I checked, this was the number one podcast coming out of Ohio. And we're going to see you in a minute, boy. <laughs> Bye. <laughs> Bro, you silly as hell. One time for the queen, and you already know, make some noise for your boy. Oh. It's, it's cut different, baby. Uh, yeah. <laughs> <laughs>